Hello, my friends. Welcome again to another episode of Eureka Math. Today, we are going to subtract fractions with unlike denominators, which means the denominators are not the same. Okay, my friends. So let's get to it. Our first step is going to be, well, before I continue today, I am the rock. I am what makes things happen, my friend. This is it. Today is December 12, 16. Now we're going to get to it. So our first fraction is one half, and our second fraction is one third. So we got to subtract them. My friends, it's really important that you always pay attention to the symbol. Pay attention to the symbol. That way you will know if it's an addition or a subtraction. A common error by my students, they all sometimes don't see it and they add or do other things that will give them the wrong answer. So here we go, one half. So the denominator tells us that this whole is divided in two parts. Unlike this one, this one says that the, the denominator tells us that the model has to be divided in three parts. The numerator tells us that it, only one is shaded. So we're going to shade only one. And the numerator on the second fraction for the subtraction is also telling us to do the same thing. Now, here's what happens, my friends. We're going to we're going to multiply or, or divide the the part in, with using the opposite denominator. So in this case, 2 is the denominator for this fraction. The opposite is 3. So 1 two, three. We, div we divide that in three parts. What we are basically doing, we're multiplying the fraction by three thirds. Okay. Now we're going to use the opposite denominator, which is two, to multiply the one by two. And we have to divide it in half because this is what we did on the model. So now if we uh, do the operation, this will be three sixes. 2 times 3 equals 6, 2 times 1 equals 2, and 2 times 3 equals 6. Now we have like denominators. And our answer has to match with the model. We have 6 all together and 3 are shaded. Correct. We have 6 all together and 2 are shaded. Correct. Okay, now, my friends, our next step is going to be to rewrite the fraction. Step 2. Rewrite fraction. Fraction, subtraction. Let's make a rhyme here. Subtraction. So our original subtraction was one half minus one third, which now is three sixes minus two sixes. That's fairly simple, my friends. Let me move the, my, my working area up. So now our step number three is fairly simple. We have to rewrite and show model for subtraction. Rewrite and show model for Subtraction, my friends. You don't have to write this uh, description, but it's always helpful to remember, and and it will help you say it in a um, explain your thinking and know the steps, and you can verbally describe them. So let's see. So our subtraction is three sixes minus two sixes. See now. We can easily do that subtraction over here, my friend. But let me show you the model. We have three sixes, which is this is the way we began, three sixes. So we have, um, that is three, and we currently have, it's going to become six. We have three sixes. One, two, and three. Okay, now what, what this is saying is 
subtract two of them. So we're going to subtract two of them. One, two. And what do we have left? We have left one six. So that is the answer here. As you can see, three minus two equals one, and the denominator stays the same. Our answer is going to be, so one half minus one third equals one six is the difference. Okay, my friends, review the video, watch it again, pay attention, ask questions. Pause the video. Pause the video, my friend. Okay? Get it done. Be successful today, at least for this lesson. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you soon.